As we continue to look into ways and in how to make it in San Diego, affordability certainly a big focus. Instead of looking into how to stretch your paycheck, we're looking into a growing market of high paying jobs in the biotech scene. And you don't need an advanced degree to land one of these gigs. 10 News reporter Jared Aarons joins us from the Live Center. Jared, the salaries, they're nothing to sneeze at. No, they're not, Mary Jason. There are dozens of biotech companies in San Diego, and you don't need to be a scientist, and you don't need to own a lab coat or have a PhD or anything to get a good job in the biotech field. In fact, the experts I spoke to say you just have to be willing to put in the time to learn something new, and you can be on your way to a six-figure salary. The idea of the scientific method, just in everyday thinking. Ashley Reynolds knew as a kid that she loved science. I like to know why things work, how things work, how to make things work better. But the more she learned, the more she realized she didn't have a love for the lab. I would say probably my third year in college, I realized that it wasn't going to be that for me. <laughs> Rather than give up, Reynolds oh, dug in. She got a master's degree in regulatory affairs, combining her love for science with a desire to help others. The regulatory affairs is just as, just as important as any other department in an organization because if you can't sell the greatest idea you have, then what's the point of it? Reynolds' story is common in the growing biotech field. As companies expand, they need people outside the lab to handle other aspects of the industry. The companies need people skilled in IT, HR, admin, accounting, sales. Lisa Bozinovich runs the Biocom Institute in La Jolla, a trade association for the industry. She says 88% of biotech companies in California plan to expand and hire in the next year. The average salary, $117,000. But you don't need an advanced degree to land a job. A couple of courses at a community college will help get get enough skills to transfer into the industry from something totally different. Bozinovich says companies want people with lab skills, but not necessarily lab degrees. And they're now working with community colleges to fast track certificate programs. Reynolds says it's well worth the investment. What do you want to do? Make a path to get there and don't even worry about all the other obstacles in your way. Because if you're determined enough to get there, you will get there. Reynolds and Bazinovich both told me the best way to get started is go to some career fairs or even some science fairs, talk to the companies that are there and see which areas interest you the most. And then we've made it easy to get started after that. If you go to Making It in San Diego on the 10 News website, this article has some links to all the different community college programs and all the different uh, biotech employment opportunities that you can find online. Again, that's at 10news.com. In the Live Center, Jared Aarons, 10 News. Thank you, Jared. So if you want to vote in next month's midterm elections, today's your last day to register in California. And remember that if you've recently moved, you'll have to fill out a new registration form as well. And we have a link to do that on 10news.com as well. Just go there. You could also use our 10 News app to do that. Go to the Your Voice, Your Vote section. You can also find your polling place and get more information on how to vote by mail. San Diego 